Hi everyone, uh, we are playing Adam, and uh, we are playing the Modern Prometheus by Seamus on uh, Netrunner DB. And this is Sync we are up against, and uh, they're not wasting any time. We'll keep this hand. Um, so, gotta run, so let's run HQ, see if we can get through whatever it is. I always ABR through it. Okay, so it's a little engine. That's fine. Don't really care about that. Uh, let's draw. It'll be good for next turn. Uh, let's let's see what we want to do here. Let's career fair out our Earthrise. And play our Corroder or play our Love Good. Um, or we can play our Public Sympathy and draw a card. That actually seems better. Let's do that. Cool. So um, I've been really enjoying this list. I think it's one of the best Atom builds I've seen so far. Uh, it's uh, no surprise that it's rated highly on NRDB. And, um, okay. So we, we have E3 in the deck, so we can deal with this and gain a bunch of money, which is kind of awesome. Uh, unfortunately, we don't find it this turn. Uh, it's only got four credits, so we're probably going to hit some sort of tagging crap. But let's run R&D and see what we can hit. Yeah, it's fine. So I'll get some money. Little engine again. Okay, so this is a very strange little engine deck. I'm okay with that. Mm. Let's see. Do we want to career fair out Dr. Lovegood? Yeah, I think we kind of do. We want to start getting uh, some economy and we want to set up. So next turn, we're not going to run. Make this just a little bit bigger for everybody. Okay, so we got two servers here. Um, let's see. Let's blank. Uh, actually, let's blank neutralize. So we'll run uh, server three. See if there's anything trying to be sneaked out here. Probably just a news team. Reality 3D. Um, huh. That's interesting. Okay. Um, let's gain some money. Play Armitage and drop a corroder. That seems okay. We'll draw a card. And we'll draw two more cards. I really do like Earthrise. I love, love Career Fair Earthrise in this deck. We have two bad pub. <laughs> Hooray. So. Got to res. That's fine. Okay. Are we back to where we were? Yeah, okay. So four credits, three clicks. Installing here. That's probably another little engine. Hmm. Um, there's nothing in archives, so we might as well just get some money. Let's get some money. Let's start drawing pretty heavily. Okay. Um, I'm not opposed to playing this, playing this. Okay, seems good. This deck just spews money. It has so much money. I do love the public sympathies in this deck just because it, it's fodder later on. Um, oh, I don't think we're running a, uh, an independent thinking. kind of wish we were. Uh, it's good to get our get us going. Kind of neutralizes the safety first drawback. Okay. 
Okay, so we got a remote. Um, could be Keegan. I have a feeling this is a Keegan deck. But, um, yeah. So, blanking ADR. Okay. Um, let's draw. Let's draw. That's pretty good. Just get set up. So, unless this is double little engine, I think we're going to be okay. It very well could be double little engine. That would be somewhat obnoxious, but, you know, what can you do? So far, we've gotten every single draw from our safety first. This card is just so good um, in non-Scorch deck matchups. And I don't know if we're playing against a Scorch deck right now. It's a little hard to say. Okay. Um, we're going to run HQ. So this costs us eight to break a little engine, and we have two for the run, so it effectively costs us six. Okay. Um, we're just going to click through that. Match six, break, break. Gain five. Pretty good. All right, let's see two cards. Anything good? Biotic Labor and Jackson. Okay. That's fine. Um, all right, five hand size. Do we want to play out our another public sympathy just to get the draw? Um, hmm. I'm not opposed to that. We should probably check server four in case it's an astro. Um, I would hate to be tagged, but let's check it anyway. I, I really don't want to get an astro snuck out on us. That's team sponsorship. We will trash that. Okay. Yeah, if, it, if that was a news team, we would have taken the minus one point. So at this time, we're not really worried. Um, but we've got tons of money. We can get in here fairly easily. The extra bed pub is really helping. It's going to get rid of the little engine. That's pretty smart. Okay. So what is this? Um, this is another little engine. Uh, let's run RD. Let's put some pressure on this runner or this corp. What is this? Okay, let's break that. And we'll ABR through this. Free looks on RD are very good. Sweep sweep. Okay. Um You know, I am going to actually career fair this thing out. Uh, public sympathy. You never know when you need a bigger hand size. I saw the biotic labor, so I'm not worried about Scorch, but that is very good for us. RDI is very good. Uh, now we can just continually pressure this. Um, ooh, okay, trashing ice. I wonder if we should trash these things. It's not horrible. I might actually want to do that. Let's let's go do that. Uh, let's run server two. Let's trash this thing. And then, uh, you know, let's just run server three and trash that thing, because we don't want the corp to have money. And then, let's gain money. Um, let's gain some more money. Seems good to me. All right. Extra ABR, just in case. I like having an extra one. Uh, this is my only include to the stack. It is not part of the original list. Um, I added one ABR and one neutralize all threats, because just in case you end up running into uh, some tag me decks, you can lose them. 
Um, so I'd rather not lose them all uh, entirely. I'd rather have an extra backup just in case. That's just my preference. So what do you want to do here? I think the goal is Um, let's uh, look good for ABR and let's uh, draw some cards there's a yog that is going to what is that going to do for us not too much but we do want to get it down so we'll play it draw a mimic that's also awesome we really want to hit an, uh, an agenda here so uh, not sure Archangel, we can click through that, get three suckers, and then we can just yog through an Archangel. That's pretty good. So uh, we might have to do that next turn. Archangel, Archangel could be a problem. Um, I was kind of not very happy with this card when it first came out, Dr. Lovegood. I thought it was, I don't like cards that turn other, turn other cards off, but I love the flavor of your sort of like faulty with your directives and he somehow makes you better for a turn. I think that's pretty awesome. And now we're going to run uh, HQ. Let's see if we can get a couple of looks on here. Architect would be kind of annoying. It's a data raven. Um, huh. You know, I think think hmm. we're going to take a tag and continue trace So we have two bed pub to beat the trace already. Um, I already did that. Okay, so three, so we'll boost it by three. All right, we're not gonna let that happen. And then we're gonna AVR through this. So we got pop-up window and quantum predictive. Well, that's sad. I'm gonna remove a tag. Okay, got a stim hack. So we can kind of deal with this. We really want to. There's 15 cards left in the deck. These kinds of decks go really fast, but they need to go fast. And it doesn't look like they're getting all, they're getting their uh, um, their money, or sorry, their well, money plus agendas. So, really, what we can do is um, we can let's see, run archives, see if we hit anything. There are probably a new couple news teams in there. Pop a window, okay. It's using Jackson now. Um, I'm just going to jack out. I think that's a mistake. You should probably wait until I'm going to access uh, before using Jackson, uh, not during encounter. Uh, so then we're going to click some money, click some money, install RDI. All right. So, uh, we're doing alright. This could be an Astro. Or was that the same card? No, nope, same card. So this is some upgrade. It's probably Keegan. Okay. Interesting. Um. Hmm. Yeah, let's 
Should we go for this? I think we gotta go R and D this turn. I'd like to stim hack this. Stim hack R and D. So you get a couple looks here. So none of these cards are really that important. Uh, it's totally fine. Also totally fine. I don't know about this play. Uh, now the question is, do I... Let's see, you can pump it by 13. Um, trace. Yeah, I don't uh, really want to break this. Seven. So yeah, we'll just pay seven. It's all stim hack money anyway. And we'll see two cards. Pachinko sponsorship. Bummer. Uh, last click. Let's check server five. Pop up. Um. Were we okay taking one point? Minus one point. Yeah, I'm fine with that. <clears throat> Let's see what it is. Could be trying to sneak something out here. It's just a Jackson. Now, I would have just let that go. I didn't have enough credits to actually trash him. So. Alright, so 20 cards left in R&D. Uh, we need some money. So let's draw. Okay, that's money. Let's gain a credit. <clears throat> so we had a lot of money going on early. Hit all of our cash, but now we don't have anything. We would like to find a Cotty Jones. Sorry about that. Forgot that was on. Uh, back to the game. All right. So another thing here. He's probably expecting us to run it again. Um, so we can get through R and D and see two more cards, and I think that might be worth it. Let's go R and D. Break. I mean, R&D locking him right now is very, very good. Pachinko. Sweeps. Bummer. Uh, yeah, let's just gain a credit, and we'll draw a card, I guess. Three, four, five, six. So six is my hand size. Three, five, six, seven, six. Yeah. Okay. I'm definitely going to need to play this out. What is that? Hmm. Well, let's see what it is. Is it a raven? I think it's a raven we just check out. Um, yeah, we'll click that. And if there's another one, we're in trouble. Um, yeah, we'll check out. Um, Let's see, we'll play this and just end the turn, draw a card. Okay, get back into our money. Can still lock R&D. Um, might be some good stuff in hand. Ooh. Okay, it's a Beal. Right. Yep, sweeps is good against us. Hmm. Do we want to try for HQ? We knew it was sweeps. Let's go R&D. There's two new cards in R&D. Break. And we'll just click through. Oops. Break.
really want to score an agenda here. Haven't even seen a, a brain chip yet, which is interesting. Uh, I believe I play three. Maybe two. We'll break that. So free looks on R and D, very good. Let's uh, score something. There's a Beal. There's a Quantum. We're on the board. Uh, let us gain a credit and the turn. So unless we get mid seasoned, we're in good shape. Okay. Another Beal? Astro? Another Beal. Okay. So I imagine that he would score the Beal only in the case that there is no Astro in hand, right? Um, blanking ABR. Uh, let's play this. Crashing um, that. Let's run R and D. Break. Break. Then one, two, three. Break. Let's see if we get lucky on R and D. An a oh, we had to trash the sand sand. Bummer. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. So we could take another shot at HQ, but I have a feeling that we're not going to be able to do anything with that. There's probably another cat in hand. Uh, huh. Well, let's draw. Yeah, it's not very good this matchup. Sweeps. Stellar card in server one. Okay. I don't know what that is, but we don't care about it. We're just gonna keep doing our thing. Hopefully we get lucky. Because honestly, yeah. That's fine. Dilute that R and D. Um, one, two, three. Break. Sweeps, sweeps. Really? Huh. I don't know what this is, but it's not an agenda because it would have been scored. Could have been a NAPD. Did we see any NAPDs earlier? I think so. I imagine it can't be an NAPD, right? It's got to be something else. So we'll gain some credits. Um, there's two things in archives. Gain some credits. Gain some credits. All right. Not much going on here. Biotic labor. Oh, it's food. Okay. I'll play this. Yeah, so that was a good play by him. I thought it could have been that. Uh, I'm not sure we could have actually got to that. Maybe we should have just checked it. We didn't see anything. There's probably like two more food in archives. Pachinko and pop up. Oh, ah, I should have contested that. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, uh. Just narrowly lost, I'd say. Uh, but Adam, thanks for watching, everyone.